solve a problem like a coder, well, Dubai is in search of the next set of coders. And talking more about it, we have Saeed, who's heading the One Million Arab Coders program. The idea behind it came as part of uh, an increase in, one, the population of the Arab world. There are more than 400 million uh, Arabs in, around the world, actually, not just in the Arab world. But how do we contribute to the global economies, not just uh, around the world, but even in the Arab world, and to uplift a whole uh, civilization, so to speak, and, non, and no other way to do that is to learn the language of the future. Basically, uh, people can log in and create their own profiles and pick uh, some of the coding tracks, whether they want to learn Android basics or web development or app development or data analysis, which is the foundation to artificial intelligence. Uh, and they would take it over a course of 45 to 60 hours, depending on their uh, schedules. Uh, that could take up to two weeks or up to three to four months. So how will OMAC uh, impact the key economic sectors of Dubai and the Arab world? We are reliant on systems today that are based on coding, whether it's trying to deliver food uh, and, and to uh, buy groceries, uh, investing in the stock market, or even playing some video games uh, or some, some e-learning uh, systems. And being able to not only understand that, but to write it allows you to be able to contribute to a much larger uh, economy and to a movement towards the future. Well, we concluded the One Million Arab Coders Initiative and His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum announced that we have reached the KPI that he has given the team uh, of 1.2 million people enrolled into the program. And uh, inshallah by Expo we will be announcing and rewarding the best, best coder of, of that batch.